Hey babes! Welcome back! If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe y'all press that button down below and subscribe you know i love you become a youtube family you know get with the game get with the program get with your girl anyways um this vlog we're going to prince edward county so this is an hour and a half away from downtown toronto ontario so if you want to take a little day trip with your friends um you can definitely do that it is a phenomenal place to go to there are some hidden gems in there so take this journey with me and let's go to prince edward county First arrival, we had brunch at the Sailor House Cafe. So at the Sailor House Cafe, you order your food. So the menu's right here. And then you go up because of COVID-19, you go up and you place your order and then you go have a seat and your food will be served to you. The brunch was muy bene. That, that ain't French. The brunch was muy bien okay it was so good i had the french toast there with some eggs and some hash browns in there and some bacon the bacon was a little crispy but that's how i like it and if you like it too you can check it out definitely order the french toast definitely and they had the cutest little puppy he was oh he was heart melting. He opens the door by himself. He guards the place. He makes sure everyone's nice. He's your little server too. So cute. But anyways, after brunch, of course, we had to get some wine in our system. We just arrived at the winery and he's gonna explain to us behind me of what we can taste. And the second one here is Vidal and Frontenac Blanc. This one, slightly off dry, has stone fruit, melon, pear, and citrus note. Do we? Do you do the stomping of the grapes? No, stuff? I mean I have a machine to do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean you could, I guess, you know, go old school. It comes from the tools and things like give that extra kick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they they like their wines with a little. A little bit of toe. Yeah. <laughs> a little funkiness. A little right? funkiness. <laughs> Look at this face. She don't even know I should have been drinking. Exactly. So don't you don't know if the wine that you've been drinking is all toes. Tom, stop, stop. And the wine, they were okay. But, you know, it's alcohol, it's wine. If you're a whiny, I'm so sorry of my lack of description. But I was just there to drink. I was baby free that day okay baby free but anyways we had some wine we saw some sheep some hairless sheep they were shaven their fur was gone their little puffs were taken away to make some stuff wool whatever it makes um, and we saw chickens we saw so many wild animals so many earthy things that we don't have in the city in Toronto so if you want to get away from the hustle and bustle of the city if you want to get away from Rona because you know Rona has kept us inside for so long we have to go somewhere after the wine tour <clears throat> we went and visit um, lavender farms there were no lavenders in season when well there were a little bit of lavenders in season, to be honest with you. Um, there wasn't a lot. Hopefully next time we go, they, were, they will be in full bloom, but they weren't this trip. For us, it was free of cost because they weren't in full bloom. So we were allowed to just go and take a stroll, but their gift shop is open where you can get all these type of oils and scents and all these things. If you're into that, you can definitely check that out too. So after the lavender farms, we went to Slicker's Cream and we grabbed some ice cream. Oh my goodness. 
I had some coconut cream ice cream. It was like a, the bounce with bounty bar in it. Mm, it was good. It was real good. Okay, so if you want to check that out as well, you can. That's another pit stop that you can check. Let's now take a moment for Sang Bang, Sand Bang Beach. I'm from Jamaica, right? To all my Jamaican people out there, I come from Mobile, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm used to white sand beach and crystal clear blue waters, okay? That's what I'm used to. And I didn't know they have something so similar like that in Ontario. If you come from Yad and you expect the same thing, don't. But for Ontario standards, it was pretty damn good. I'm not gonna lie to you. But this beach, it had white sand, silky, go in the water. It was crystal clear. Like I could see my toes when I stepped in the water. And that's saying something, okay? Um, I had fun. That's definitely a to do. If you go to Prince Edward County, you have to check this beach out Sand Bank Beach. My boyfriend even went in, dived in, and took a swim. And in Comfraya too. So, this is saying something, right? You guys have to check this beach out. You have to check it out, okay? And after the beach, we were hungry. There was this restaurant there that had a beautiful view. So our last stop of the day is to get some dinner. We are thinking about the Miller House Cafe, which is right behind me. It's right on the water, so you get a nice, beautiful, scenic view while you have a meal. We're not sure if we're gonna eat here as yet. We're just checking out the menu. Yes, you can check that out and see if you wanna chance their menu. We didn't feel like what they have on the menu was suitable for our palette at the moment but if it is for you you can definitely check it out it has a view their patio looks phenomenal so it's up to you anyways thank you guys so much for watching this vlog if you didn't already don't forget to subscribe press that button press the bell one for a notification whenever i put out a new video and definitely like this video be a part of my youtube family join the club get ready for new videos coming your way and i will see you guys next time yeah that was good <laughs>